really want to talk to you guys about today is me theoretically solving the Middle East peace conflict. And my answer comes in the form of one word. Snow. <laughs> People lose their shit when they sneeze snow, don't they? And don't tell me there's not a direct correlation between the lack of snow in the Middle East and the high amount of conflict. <laughs> and think of all the happy, snow-covered, peaceful nations we have in this great world of ours. Finland, Sweden, Norway, Russia. <laughs> They're all covered in snow, to be fair. Three out of four isn't bad, though. 75% hit rate, good enough to me. Um, but you know, like, so I'm demanding that we all storm the UN now. We go tell them, let's chop the snow over to the Middle East. And there'll be cynics out there, there always are, who say that's too hot for snow in the Middle East. But to them I say this. When you see the face of that little Middle Eastern kid as he runs out to play in that slightly damp sand, <laughs> that's when we know it's worth it. <laughs> never going to happen. It's a great idea. Yes, I agree with you. But it's never going to happen. We live in too pessimistic a world. Like, I'm a pessimist myself. I'm part of the problem. Like, an optimist can go and say, oh, then life gives you lemons. Get lemonade. That's not how you make lemonade. You need sugar. All you've got there is a glass of very ironically bitter juice. <laughs> when life gives you lemons, so I came up with my own pessimistic version. When life gives you sugar, get diabetes. <laughs> Poke a hole in that one, optimist. Probably don't want to, do you? Probably just want to praise me for being creative. <laughs> There's one other phrase I really hate at the moment, and it's ignorance is bliss. Because a lot of people say racism is born from ignorance. <laughs> And if racism is bliss and ignorance is born is because it's racism, what I'm saying is happiness is racist. <laughs>